Hello everybody and welcome back to Screen Stars. I'm here today to review the classic 1978 film Hooper that stars Burt Reynolds, Sally Field, Adam West and Jan Michael Vincent. And with the recent um, sad death of Burt Reynolds, I wanted to do um, a little classic film review, my little tribute to Burt Reynolds as um, people of a similar age to me will remember growing up to many a Burt Reynolds film um, a big part of my childhood as was Clint Eastwood in in molding my likes and dislikes for movies and I think it's fair to say a lot of Burt Reynolds films certainly in this era in the 70s and 80s um, were a lot of fun to watch if even if you couldn't regard them as, you know, like, you know, cinema masterpieces. Cannonball Run, Smokey and the Bandit, classic fun movies that were great to watch. Um, just sh Burt Reynolds' charisma on screen and that iconic laugh and his great sense of humour on screen always shone through. Um, in these movies and this film Hooper is no exception and this is arguably my personal favorite Bruce uh, Bruce Burt Reynolds film this is a film I, I used to watch endlessly as a child growing up um, I absolutely loved it and it's another one of those that I remember watching with my dad and um, having a great time with it and this actually is a love letter to stuntmen by Burt Reynolds and the director of this film, Hal Needham, who Burt Reynolds made many a film with, including the aforementioned Cannonball Run, the Smoking the Bandits, etc. Um, because as you may or you may not know, that early in his career, Burt Reynolds was a stuntman, as was the director, Hal Needham. So they had an awful lot of respect for the industry of stuntmen. And this was their way of saying thank you to the stuntmen. And this focuses on this film on um, Burt Reynolds character Hooper who is an aging stuntman um, and primarily the majority of this film is on a film set um, and he's in charge of all the stunts for the film um, Adam West uh, who you'll know from obviously the classic 60s show Batman he's like the main star of the film and Burt Reynolds fills in as his stunt double so um, what happens in this movie is Early in the movie, Jan Michael Vincent turns up, who is the new young hot stuntman of the times. He does all these crazy stunts um, and he outshines everybody and Hooper feels a little bit threatened by him. However, he recognises his talent and brings him on board on this movie that they're making to collaborate with him. Um, and so basically this film is Burt Reynolds doing his signature stuff. It's full of uh, bar fights, um, it's full of, you know, comedy, it's full of great stuff. As you would imagine, a film about stuntmen, they really pull out the stops here in regards to the stunts, certainly for the time. And it's, it's, a, it's an awful lot of fun to watch this film. Um, ridiculous bar fights, um, car chases, stunts, humour, fun. Um, it's almost it, it, very similar in its comedy stylings to you know the Clint Eastwood Every Which Way But Loose film. Um, it's fun, but it doesn't take itself too seriously, and it doesn't ask you to take it too seriously. It's one of those films you can put on watch and have a real, real good time watching it. So, um, I personally would like to say to thank uh, Burt Reynolds for all the memories. Um, fantastic actor for his time and obviously you know he's continued making great films buggy nights things like that he's, he's always remained in people's thoughts in regards to his acting and genuinely a at the time in the 70s late in the 70s and early 80s he was a powerhouse in the industry and made some of the best movies of that time that um, audiences wanted to see he didn't take himself too seriously and he's a lot of his films didn't want us to take him too seriously so i thank him for that i thank him for all the memories and i thank him for this film hooper because 
genuinely guys it is a lot of fun this film if you do get an opportunity to see it they do show it quite a lot you know bank holiday weekends and all this kind of stuff it's probably shown very regular um, all over the place on, on TV cable whatever you've got so for me guys I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10 for nostalgia mainly it's a lot of fun this film it is worth watching it's cram packed full of great stunts and um, many of them that you watch you'll you'll recognize from clips from other shows and movies and things like that so yeah guys rest in peace Bert Reynolds we will always remember you and thank you very much for watching everybody hi this is just a quick message from me to thank you very much for watching this video and for checking out the channel please do me a huge favor and click that like button please leave as many comments as you like on the videos and of course don't forget to click that subscribe button and if you do click that subscribe button click the notification bell as well so that you never miss out on any content that I put up on YouTube so thanks very much for watching guys I really do appreciate it and I'll see you next time on screen stars